Reckless driving, some waving guns through downtown St. Louis. Some residents say the root of the problem is short-term rentals. And one local group tells our Gabriela Vidal city leaders aren't doing enough to fix the problem. She's live downtown. Yeah, Sam, well, this weekend we saw big crowds here for the Cardinals weekend home opener and the public safety leaders say that there was relative, it was relatively quiet in terms of safety, but some residents who live in the downtown area say one issue they say hasn't taken the weekend off. A new Cardinal season kicked off with a busy weekend downtown. We did have a pretty significant contingent of officers and visibility downtown over the weekend. So I do believe that even though there were some incidents, um, a lot of you know, what could have happened was um, was deterred. But some downtown residents were very frustrated at this point are saying one particular problem still isn't being addressed when it comes to safety. You know, this weekend, like so many others uh, recently, we've been affected by parties being hosted in these short term rentals and, you know, reckless driving and loud cars and and brandishing of weapons and uh, all sorts of things like that. These videos from over the weekend shared by citizens for greater downtown St. Louis are concerning to residents like Les Sturman. He believes reckless driving downtown and disturbances from young people are as a result of the city not taking a tougher stance against the use of rental properties downtown as Airbnbs. I mean, having cops is great. Um, I think that helps as a deterrent. Uh, but I think we've got to deal with some of the underlying issues that bring some of the negative activity downtown. Today, Public Safety Director Dan Isom responded to concerns from residents. There is some more investigative work we need to do. Um, we, we believe that we might know of a, a particular group who is renting out uh, these locations. As you might imagine, it's uh, difficult to know ahead of time uh, when uh, a apartment or a location is rented out, um, but it's something that certainly we're working on to try to you know, get more real-time information. Well, city leaders have expressed that they're working on an ordinance to regulate short-term rentals. People like Sturman feel like the problem is still being dragged out. And we're always told, well, we're working on it, we're working on it. Well, can we, can we see a draft of an ordinance? We're working on it. During today's public safety meeting, uh, Greater St. Louis Inc. announced a new inactivation to bring more people in a positive way to the downtown area, particularly here in Washington. They're creating this thing called a City Social, which will take place on Friday, April 29th, where there's going to be DJ, music, live events, uh, an opportunity for people to come down and gather together in the downtown area. And we'll have more information on that on KMOV.com and on our news app. Reporting live, Gabriella Vidal, News 4. Gabby, thank